And they have six games remaining in this season, including three at home, including this one. That puck deflects off a Norwich stick. Bay State and Norwich this season. Over the course of the regular season, these two rivals have gotten at it plenty of times, though the Bobcats have certainly controlled the season series as they have won all nine games, three of them coming in overtime. In the corner, trying to work it on out for the Bobcats is Dylan Gallagher. Instead, stolen away, and Tony Moran, the 0-4 defenseman, will gain his own blue line and swing it along for Ethan Ranger. Norwich's leading scorer takes a shot that goes wide. Moran pinching in from the point, couldn't get a handle on the puck. Knocked out of the zone by Tetsana. And now Gallagher sends one down deep. Gallagher. Beaten to the puck by Kinahan, who sends this all the way around. It takes a weird hop off the kick plate, so Damon Warren can't keep it alive. Matt Sherm at center ice will send it along and back on down into the zone. Warren the first one there. He's watched by a pair of sea captains in the corner. Ethan Ranger able to come up with possession. He sends it softly behind the cage for Sachs. Sachs then sends a pass that's too far for Kinahan. This rolls on down into the D2D across for Hayden. Hayden's pass off the stick of Essing into the Bobcat zone. They quickly send it on out. Well, neither team able to really possess the puck for any extended amount of time. And when we say extended amount of time, we're talking in the span of seconds right now. Essing sends one down deep. First one there is more set for the Cats, and they're able to clear it on out. Tim Hayden below the red line will send it back on down. Di Fiore leaves it behind the cage, and now Ryan Janik swings over far side for Paya Tetsana. Tetsana, a long pass, can't quite connect with Gallagher. He'll still chase after it. Gallagher and Moran come together. Puck goes behind the net. Gallagher still battling for the puck. On the far side, half wall. Gallagher finally knocked off. Flipped out of the zone by Sack. Chasing after this is Ethan Ranger. No icing on the play. Ranger with some speed. A centering feed for Sacks, knocked away by Sherm. Now Sacks tries going back to Moran at the point. Moran. Under some duress, still managed to send one towards the front of the cage at Ethan Ranger, then deflects into the corner. Big Nick Sachs behind the net. Sachs, far side corner, tried to connect once again with Ranger. Damon Warren had other ideas, and the Bobcats get it over the blue line. Now a two-on-one developing for Basie. Pass across the way, goes off the skates of Moran, and then Moran dives on out and blocks another pass. Shot from the point off the chest of Pellerito. Off the high glass on the sidewall, it stays in play. Sherm, far side. Broken up by Sachs, cleared down the ice. This should be icing against the Sea Captains. And back to touch up. Patrick Christo is dressed as the backup, though Yoakum has certainly put a strong case together for owning the Norwich crease for the rest of this season. Pellery on the kill, the sea captains right in the middle of the pack, 18th overall. They kill off 72 and a half of their penalties and they're able to clear it off the opening face off. Di Fiore sends around behind the cage for Montague. Montague will chip one back over into the far side. First one there is Ethan Ranger whose shot goes wide. Now Jameson Bain. Wanted to get it back deep into the Bobcat zone. Stolen away by Montague. Montague gets around Smith and gets dumped down to the ice as Jamison Bain gets back into a defensive position. Montague back up to his skates, now stepping on in. A shot. It bounces around in the blue paint. Jamison Bain comes up with possession, and he's able to clear it on down. Ethan Ranger chasing after us. Di Fiore will come out of his cage. He'll shovel one around near side for Nate Mastroni. Mastroni up ahead, Landon Booth. Here comes Bay State's captain over the Norwich blue line. Booth, nice move to get around Romita. Centering feed ends up in the air behind the cage. Mastroni down to his knees. Possession taken by Essing, and he'll send it all the way down. Towards center ice, he simply chips it into the Bay State zone, and so they'll turn it around with Jace Demaray. Demaray, with his hair flowing out of his helmet, drives into the corner. A centering feed knocked away by Smith. A Montague, a drive from the blue line, just goes wide. Now Beaupre tries sending down low, wanting to hook up with Tedsana, stolen away by Ethan Ranger instead. Ranger knocked away by Beaupre. Kinahan fresh off the bench will chip it on down. Logan Beaupre, a native of Gatineau in Quebec. 
Couple good junior teams have called Gatineau home as Romita, the Ontarian, has his shot blocked. Another shot by Tim Hayden, also blocked for it got through to Di Fiore. Oh, had a nice little set. So a face off outside the Norwich zone. On a 50-50 draw, Damon Warren able to win it on back. Woke will send it down deep. Pellerito leaves it behind his cage and puts a pass through the legs of Hayden. Hayden able to quickly reset. D to D behind for Romita. Knifed out of the zone by Kinahan, but sent right back down. Now Hayden, turning away from the pressure of Demaray. Goes across for Romita, can't complete with Kinahan. Woke flips it back down deep. And now Romita, with no help on the near side, while now Essing becomes an option, but Romita's already turned around and gone back up the same way. Ethan Ranger tries chipping it off the wall. Damon Warren knocks it down. Now Ranger again, this time played up for Matteo Romita. And Romita from the red line will get it off the skates of Loftus. And now Sean Loftus, the defenseman, will become the first four checker. Sent up towards center ice, deflected into the zone by Tedsana. First one, two, it's Ethan Ranger. Tedsana right on top of him. Tedsana, well, I'm not sure if he got caught up high, but kind of stopped his pursuit of the puck. Meanwhile, the Bobcats still with the puck in the offensive zone as the puck ends up on the far side. Kinahan able to play it off the wall. Penning at center ice, right back into the Norwich zone. 5.13 to go in a fast-moving first period. Here's Loftus. His pass goes through the legs of Kinahan, and that works out in the sea captain's favor as it's Brian Essen caught from behind, however, by Logan Beaupre. Ethan Ranger tried swinging one towards the front. Beaupre there to steal that. And now Logan Beaupre to the outside, working his way around Hayden. Beaupre in the corner, has an option at the point, and Brian Woke, who's covering in his position, instead Kinahan able to steal it away from the Quebecer. At center ice, here's Romita, tried to one-hand one up ahead. Instead, it'll be Jace Demaray coming back the other way. Demaray towards the front of a net, a loose puck in the crease, getting a glove on it for the Norwich Sea Captains. They are two of the three leading scorers. Brian Essing offside. What the issue is, Damon Warren with the face-off win sends it out into the neutral zone where Matteo Romita is there to pick it up. Given the long for Tim Hayden. Norwich's only representative at the top prospects tournament sends the puck all the way down the ice. No icing on the play. Nice hit thrown by Kinahan. That should free things up. Behind the cage, here's Ethan Ranger. A centering feed knocked away by Sherm, the only goal scorer. And now here come the Bobcats two on two the other way. It's Brian Woke from a long ways away, missing the net wide. Wraps all the way around the boards. Picked up at center ice by Beaupre, and he's able to connect with Woke. Brian Woke with 90 seconds to go in the period. His shot flutters over the top of the cage. Warren a centering feed, stolen away by Ranger. And now Jack Kinahan, poked away by Demaray. Kinahan, however, able to get it back. That goes off of somebody on the Bobcats bench, but play continues. Trying to look as innocent as possible on the Bobcats bench was Mike Montague as he took that off the glove. But no harm, no foul. 107 to go in the period as here's Troy Harwell. One on one, or I'm sorry, one on. Almost doesn't seem fair when you win by a couple touchdowns. Back underway, second period has begun. Bay State in their blue uniform skating from right to left. Norwich in the home whites skating from left to right as it's Matt Sherm, the only goal scorer in this game, sending a pass up over the blue line. Can't quite connect with Brian Woke. Sent back down into the Bobcat zone. And this time Sherm is able to get it up ahead for Damon Warren. Now Warren on a two-on-one. Warren a shot saved by Pellerito. The rebound trickles behind the cage as diving on out to block a pass was Sean Loftus. Now at the blue line, a shot gets deflected wide by Warren. Warren then steals it right back in the far side corner. He'll send it back up to Sherm. Sherm for Warren, top of the circle on goal, saved by Pellerito. The rebound by Demaray, stopped by Pellerito. Ethan Ranger trying to come up with possession. Instead, it'll be Damon Warren taking a shot that deflects out of play over. So off the draw, here's Ethan Ranger. Can't get it down deep. Behind the net of Pellerito, it's Sachs going over, far, or check that Loftus far side, not out of the zone, a shot on. And getting a piece of it was Warren, but he couldn't direct it in. Jack Kinahan looks to play off the wall. He finds Ethan Ranger, Ranger into the zone. Ranger knocked away as Brian Woke got back into a defensive position. 
Byer swings it along for Smith, deflected on goal. DeFiori gets a pad on it. Ethan Ranger behind the net, knocked down to one knee. Matt Sturm will pick up the puck, and Sturm looks to direct it on out. Off the skates of Killian Rain, or check that, off of Kinahan, sent back down into the Bay State zone. This time DeFiori will send it up the wall himself. Loftus from the blue line, deflected by Essing in front. DeFiori able to get a blocker on it. Here's Daryl Smith. Good job by Smith to hold the line. Essing gets run over by Sherm. Wrapped around to the near side wall. Loftus unable to keep it in this time as he gets battled for alongside Woke. Woke will send it on down into the Norwich zone. Daryl Smith goes hard around the boards. Corralled by Ranger, but he can't clear. Here's Demaray giving along for Warren. Warren tried to go through a pair of sea captain defenders. Lost possession of the puck. Jack Kinahan back the other way. Two on two. A shot on off the glove of DeFiori. Then DeFiori comes well out of Eden. Tony Moran back on the blue line. Off the draw. Face off one by Ethan Ranger. Puck ends up down behind the cage for Sherm. Wrapped around the board. Nice job by Moran to keep that in the zone. As Killian Ranger sends down low for Ethan. Here's Ethan behind the net. Swept away by Sherm. Jameson Bain and Sherm on the far side. Sherm able to force it up the wall, but not out. Nice keep by uh, Tim Hayden. Now Killian Ranger getting knocked down from behind was Jameson Bain. Hayden sends one towards the front of the net, getting a stick on it. Ranger on the draw. He'll win it towards the goal. DeFiori has another draw, another faceoff win by Ethan Ranger. Won it towards the slot. Jameson Bain unable to control it. And it's sent all the way down by Beaupre. So Pellerito will leave it behind the cage where Tony Moran can begin working up. Moran, an errant pass, can't connect with Killian Ranger. Flipped back down into the sea captain zone. 105 to go on the five on three advantage as Tim Hayden will lead things forward. On to the tape of Jamison Bain. Bain into the zone, drops back for Ethan Ranger. And now Moran. Moran a shot, kick save by DeFiori and cleared on out by the Cats once again. 50 seconds to go on the five on three. Pellerito plays up ahead for Tony Moran. Moran over the red line and now into the Bobcat zone. He'll swing it on back for Ethan Ranger. Ranger cutting towards the front of the net. Picks up some help from Brian Essing. Can't connect the pass to Essing, however, and the Bobcats will clear once again. 30 seconds to go on the five on three. Over six minutes gone by in the second. Here's Tim Hayden. Second unit now on the ice. For the Sea Captains, it's Bayer, Kinahan, and Essing. And Essing can't get the puck over the line. Stolen away by a fellow 19. Rules, and we'll get back to business. Here's Killian Ranger off the opening faceoff. Nate Mastroni steals it away and sends it on down. Pellerito behind the cage. And now Tony Moran. Moran, cross ice pass for Killian Ranger. That connects. Ranger deflects it into his own. Morissette able to take possession. Will Morissette? Up for Mastroni, and now on the tape of Landon Booth over the sea captain zone. Booth thrown into the wall by Hayden. Nice defensive play. Hayden comes up with possession of the puck. He'll send one far side. Off the stick of Ethan Ranger down low. Ranger tries dropping it back for Harwell. That goes off of the stick of Ryan Janik. Hayden back in his own end. Swung along Loftus. Loftus plays up the wall too far for Harwell. Tegan Beyer will chase after us. DeFiori well out of his cage. Beyer able to take it away from DeFiori, but unable to maintain possession. Then more sets pass goes through everybody. Icing is called as Darry warming up to get into this one. But it's not a house game. It's the NA3HL. Here's Ethan Ranger. Played up ahead onto the tape of Essing. Essing tries giving one ahead for Kinahan. Knocked away by Warren. In their own zone, the Bobcats look to clear. Long pass up ahead. Brian Woke can't swing it deep into the sea captain zone. Tony Moran off the glass out towards center ice. Knifed on down by Janik, but corralled by the sea captain. Paya Tetsana out there with them. Face off one by the sea captain. Face off. Let's see if they can get something going here. Off the draw. It's Sachs. Able to keep it alive at the blue line and able to get away from most of a check from Tetsana. Paya Tetsana sees this go past his stick all the way down the ice. Moran gets to the puck as it crosses the goal line. No icing now turned over. Shot saved by Pellerito. Loose puck in the slot. Picked up by Penning. And Alex Penning gets to work. Down low Tetsana. Checked by Ethan Ranger. That frees up the puck. Ethan Ranger will flip one off the boards. 
Not past the red line, however, as Sherm able to send it back the other way. Moran will send it all the way down the ice. And the Bob battled for control of the Norwich crease pretty much all season. Up ahead, here comes Jack Kinahan. One-on-one -on -one against Matt Sherm. Kinahan a shot. Now he can drop the puck legally. Off the draw, Ethan Ranger with the face-off win. Bain unable to clear. Getting tripped up on the play was Booth. No call coming as the Bobcats have to retreat out towards center ice. Here's Ian Skinner. Giving along, Landon Booth. Booth drops back Montague. Mike Montague played up ahead for Skinner. Offside, Ethan Ranger on the ensuing face-off. Won by Ranger and cleared all the way down by Bain. DeFiori will leave it to the side of his cage for Mike Montague. Montague represented Bay State at the NA3HL Top Prospects Tournament. He was there with Landon Booth as this gets flipped all the way down the ice. DeFiori will have to settle it on down. He'll play it along for Nate Mastroni. Mastroni overskates the puck in the corner then takes a hit from Moran. Chipped out towards center ice, Sacks. The first one to it, and he pitchforks one right into go in the second period. Seven seconds to go in the Cats' power play as this is Pellerito touching long for Moran. He sends one off the glass. No icing on the play as the penalty expires, and we're back to even strength hockey. Sherm suddenly finds Ethan Ranger in his lap behind the net. Here's Killian Ranger. A backhand shot stopped by DeFiori. Around the boards, back to Sack. Sack's a shot, just goes wide. Loose puck picked up Killian Ranger. Harwell goes back to Moran. Now Moran back for Harwell. Tried to cycle along further. Ethan Ranger knocked away by the defense of Paul Johnson. And now Johnson picks up a loose puck at center ice. Johnson can't get around Moran. Last man back. Sea captain's coming back the other way as Ethan Ranger by himself into the zone. Falling down on the play was Sherm, but by falling down, he took out Ranger as well. Chipped out towards center ice. Sachs plays along for Harwell. Troy Harwell, the, who started this year with Bay State, played 10 games for them, put up five points. Given long, here's e Killian Ranger. Ranger a shot, knocked away by DeFiori. Harwell picks up the rebound on the near, on the far side half wall. Harwell stepping on in. His snapshot stopped by DeFiori. Of all the defensemen here for the sea captains, spend the most time together. They're usually called upon for the important face-offs. Played back to the point, Beaupre gives along for Skinner with 47 seconds to go, a shot on, stopped by Pellerito. Pellerito was knocked down by Mastroni. Play continues, Kinahan gets wiped out as well, but played up ahead and Brian Essing will pick it up off the boards. It's a four on one down low, Essing gives a cross, uh, unable to take the shot was Romita. Now Kinahan a centering feed, goes off the skates of Essing, corralled by Mastroni. He gives along for Landon Booth with 25 to go in the period. Landon Booth cutting towards the front of the net, a backhand shot, shoulder to side by Pellerito. Loose puck in the zone, Jack Kinahan will pick it up. Kinahan, who had a breakaway earlier in this period, drops it off Essing. Essing a shot partially deflected wide. Eight seconds to go in the period. Mastroni picks up the puck in his own zone. He'll just play it up ahead. Skated on down by Romita, and that'll do it. Eight to left, puck is down, and we are underway for the third period of action. Right in front of us, Jace Demaray. Had it knocked off of his stick, Damon Warren unable to come up with possession, swung over far side, and now Brian Woke. Shoved by Kinahan at the red line, Loftus will send one on goal, and Ben DeFiori will leave it behind. As we mentioned earlier, this is the 10th and final game between these two teams during this regular season. The Bobcats have won all nine. Sea captains would certainly like to prevent the, the Bobcats from going a perfect 10-0 against them during the season. Here's Ethan Ranger. Sending it down low, cut away by Sherm. Behind the net, having trouble with the puck was Beaupre. Rolls off of his stick. Aiden Bain able to come up with possession. Swung back up to the point where Sean Loftus sends it back down low. Warren stole away from Aiden Bain. Chase Demaray taking his time to try and get it out of the zone. That goes off of a Norwich skate. And so it'll be Logan Beaupre into the zone. Beaupre run into by Loftus. And Daryl Smith 
Saw the puck roll off of his stick behind the net. He's able to reach behind and regain possession. Ethan Ranger at least gets it over the blue line before Mastroni pitchforks one back into the zone. Off the boards, here's Ethan Ranger again sending it down deep. DeFiori will come out of his cage and leave it aside for Montague. Mike Montague, an outlet pass Mastroni. Played along for Skinner. Skinner goes far side, Landon Booth. Three on three across the blue line. Booth spins away from the check of Sachs, but then has his puck stolen away by Ethan Ranger. Ranger can't get it deep as it's gloved down by Morissette. Ranger still working for the puck, however, forces a turnover onto the tape of Kinahan, whose centering feed goes through Essing. Now Kinahan a shot. That's blocked by Penning. Kinahan another opportunity on goal. He scores! Jack Kinahan on the draw. On a 50-50 draw, puck in the linesman skates. Timmy Hayden able to work it on out. And now here's Hayden over the red line and over the blue into the Bobcats zone. Sent far side, pass intercepted by Johnson. Essing following up on the play. His centering feed stolen away by Ian Skinner. And now here's Skinner up ahead onto the tape of Landon Booth. Booth drilled into the boards. What a hip check thrown by Jack Kinahan. Textbook. Here's Romita. Turning the puck over. Back up to his skates, Booth. Can't take the shot. Instead, it'll be Hayden off the glass. Fumbling the puck was Essing. Hayden once again in his own zone. Played off the skates of Kinahan. Well, Jack Kinahan certainly had himself a third period so far. Sea captains would love to see another goal go up on their side of the scoreboard. It's Ethan Ranger forcing a turnover. One on one into the zone. Ranger, a spinorama move, but canceled out by Montague. Sent over far side. Played off the boards by Booth. Too far for Penning to control. Swung back the other way. Collected by Ranger. Here's Ethan Ranger. A backhand shot. Blocker to side by DeFiori. Ethan Ranger again from behind the cage. Stolen once again away by Penning. Loftus, or check that, Sacks able to keep the puck in the zone momentarily. But dipping a shoulder and chipping it out of the zone was Paya Tetsana. Fiori. Then stepping on in from the blue line is Kinahan here. Kinahan for Kinahan. Now his 10th goal of the season, his second of the game. And the Sea Captains lead it 3 to 2. 12 minutes to go in regulation time. Shaken up behind the play for Bay State is Paul Johnson. He'll stay out on the ice. A shot on, knocked aside by Pellerito. Pellerito then from the side. Meanwhile, the Sea Captains, they've surrendered 11 shorthanded. And they can't afford to do that here. Timmy Hayden gives along for Ethan Ranger. Along for Killian, who will send it down deep. DeFiori out of his cage. He'll try and clear it out himself. Wrapped around the far side wall. Hayden holds it alive at the blue line. Ethan Ranger, however, can't gain possession. And it squirts out towards the red line. Now Tony Moran plays ahead for Jamison Bain. Bain, a touch pass for Killian Ranger outside of his reach. Chipped out of the zone by Skinner. And Moran corrals at his own blue line. 30 seconds gone by on the power play. Ethan Ranger sends down low. Killian Ranger chasing after it. Gets run into by Montague. Puck pinned up against the wall. Ethan comes in to help out. Now Killian behind the cage. Jamison Bain in there as well as all three forwards for the sea captains are below the goal line. Tim Hayden at the blue. Slowly taking his time. Keeping a close eye on things is Ian Skinner. Hayden dishes along Moran. Moran throws it across for Killian Ranger, who can't keep the puck in the zone. So Tim Hayden once again for Ethan Ranger. Ethan Ranger wants to get towards the front of a net. Flexed away by Montague. Now Jameson Bain with 40 seconds to go in the power play. Gives across Harwell a shot. Swallowed up by Ben DeFiori. Kinahan is centering feed. Nobody home wearing a white jersey. So Jace Demaray over the red line, over the blue. Demaray to the outside. Demaray a rising shot. Catches nothing but glass. Ethan Ranger picks up the loose puck. Turns it over. Demaray right back with the puck. Demaray tries dipsy doodling his way towards the front of a net. Knocked away by Romita. Kinahan looking to clear. He can't get it over the blue line either as Paul Johnson flips one in on goal. Ethan Ranger picks up the puck left aside by Pellerito. Played off the wall. And now here's Jack Kinahan. Tries to get around Mastroni. Able to do so. Can't get around Montague. Now Kinahan with the puck again. Kinahan a shot. Saved by DeFiori. Seared into the corner. Mastroni 
Plays it up towards center ice. Daryl Smith sends that off his teammate, Matteo Romita. It still got over the blue line. Bobcats look to regroup with seven minutes to go in regulation time. Mastroni chips it up ahead. Loftus steers it on along the wall for Killian Ranger. Ranger canceled out at center ice, and the Bobcats regroup once again. Here's Sherm. His pass can't connect with Skinner. Daryl Smith plays it off the wall. Two hour left. Off the draw, one by Ranger. Remember, it's a penalty for the Sea Captains, so they can shoot it onto the empty net. Off the draw. Ethan Ranger with the faceoff win. Sachs gets hit hard into the boards. Following up on the play, however, is Tony Moran. He sends it all the way down. Picking up the puck in his own crease is Mike Montague. 20 seconds gone by on the power play. Here's Landon Booth coming out from behind the cage. Booth nearly overskates the puck, tries to dump it on down. Knocked by a high stick by Mastroni. Moran got a twig on it as well, so no whistle on the play. Ethan Ranger battling for the puck right at his own blue line. Tony Moran in there as well, and Moran will send it on down. 40 seconds gone by on the power play. Here's Damon Warren. Smoked out from behind the empty net by Jamison Bain. Warren gaining speed through center ice. Across the line they come. Dropped back Demaray. Jace Demaray sends over far side Landon Booth. Booth slid along Woke. Woke in the corner looking for an option. Has Demaray. Can't connect with him as Woke splits the difference with the defense. And it goes all the way back down into their own end. 50 seconds to go on the power play. Bay State needs two to tie. Played up ahead, and Landon Booth breaks into the sea captain's zone once again. This time he hits Mastroni. A sharp angle attempt off the shot is Ian Skinner. And a puck that is battled for by both teams ends up in the corner. Wrapped around by Romita. Now Paul Johnson. Sends that, that goes off the helmet of Bayer. Bayer racing up ahead, has a pair of Bobcat defensemen to deal with. Killian Ranger following up on the play. Gets it a bit deeper. Under three minutes to go. Here's Brian Essing in front. Killian Ranger rips a shot that gets blocked. Loose puck picked up by Skinner. Reverse back long for Johnson. Brian Woke has to slide on down. He chips it up the wall, but a nice job by Hayden to keep it on in. Sent behind the cage. Here's Ethan Ranger back up to Romita at the point. He'll wind and fire, blocked before it got through. Killian Ranger tries going for Ethan behind the net. Instead, it's Ian Skinner stealing the puck away. He finds Johnson with 2.20 to go in regulation time. Here's Romita. Stolen away by Johnson. And now Mike Montague. Slowly up ahead. He'll send this one on goal. So Pellerito simply leaves it aside for Romita. Two minutes to go. Here's Nick Lipinski. Played up ahead for Schemmel.